You know, I asked around, and uh, all my friends have a handyman, so... Contractor. I'm a contractor. Yeah, yeah, of course. Yeah, totally. Yeah. Totally. Um, by the way, if you know of a good tree trimmer, let me know, because I've uh, been meaning to cut these bad boys. I could do it. Handyman. A man who works at many small jobs in and around a building, especially repairing things. And Are you okay? Did something happen at Forster's? Oh, no. Everything went great. Jordan showed me her flagship store, and uh, she invited us to her home tomorrow. So, oh. you know, usual love fest. <laughs> well, then what's going on? You seem all riled up. B or get riled up. To become very excited or angry because of something someone has done or said. Another example. This isn't one-way glass, you know. I can see you. <laughs> you know, I like Nope. I screw with her because she gets all riled up and her face gets all scrunched up like this. But I like her. She's all right. Good to see you, man. Glad you could make it. Moody? Car. I would stand, but that would expose my nether regions to attack. <laughs> I got no beef with you, Moody. I'm here on business. Beef. A meat from an adult domestic cow or bull. An argument or dispute. Informal. Another example. Hey, Lenny. Where's your old lady? Oh, we had a beef, man. We broke up. Oh, that's too bad. But don't worry, you'll get back together. No, that's it, you know. You got it! Yeah. Thank you, Daniel. We've been meaning to get someone to fix this. Ah, uh, it's nothing. It's the least I could do. So, what brought you down to Orange County? Are things slow this time of year? Slow? Yeah. Uh, no, th things are fast. Things are slow. Means, it is calm. Nothing happens. There is not much work or work orders at this time. Another example. Michael just rented the Devil Wears Prada. He has his Netflix sent here to the office and he watches them in pieces when things are slow. Steak! Where's my steak? He's a big Meryl Streep fan, so I shouldn't be surprised that he's identified with her character. I talked to Naomi and she thinks I just have to go over there and kiss the ring a little bit. Uh. Kiss the ring. To make a gesture of humble subordination and respect. Especially to a person of authority. Another example. Cynthia wants me to quit and open a b and in Vermont. <laughs> That's great. I'd love to see Mark Baumer on a bed and breakfast. Mark refused to kiss the ring of the people with the checkbook, so he had to set up his fund under Morgan Stanley's umbrella. How much? It's not for sale. George. I'm sure that there's a price. Sorry. Gotta put my foot down. Joji, Joji, Joji. Let's not play games. A hundred thousand. How's that? Put your foot down. To tell someone in a strong way that they must do something or must stop doing something. I thought you wanted me to be more assertive. Yeah, not now. There's millions of dollars on the line, you know? Assertive. Behaving confidently and able to say in a direct way what you want or believe. Another example. Are you coming to my Dia de los Muertos party? I'm definitely going to try to swing by. Oh, then I can mark you down as definitely being there from seven sharp till upside down Spanish question mark? Here's the thing. No, uh, here's the thing. I am putting my foot down, you understand? I am being assertive and I am making eye contact and it is achieving results. Are you trying to get formidable with me? All the idioms, expressions, and phrasal verbs explained on our channel. All the most useful and popular gathered in one place. Check out our PDF materials for comfortable study. Print versions available as well. Links in the description below. I just screen grabbed her photos and sent them to you. Okay, um, so you're catfishing me? To catfish. To try to trick or attract someone by pretending on social media to be someone different. Another example. Catfish. 
phishing is when you pretend to be someone you're not on the internet. You know, like everyone on the internet. <laughs> Jordan comes to me for business advice. From I time heard to time. that. Mm. Yes, I, that's a lot to juggle. Yeah, and then when Jordan gets on a roll, she will just text me nonstop. Be or get on a roll to be having a successful or lucky period. Another example. I'm proud of you, Alan. Well done. Thank you for helping me get my business going. I'll see you. Hold on. Yes? Since you seem to be on a roll, what would happen if I didn't take my investment out? Feeling I've had for a long time. Um, I, I don't remember. When it started, I, I can't pinpoint exactly when or why, but, um... To pinpoint. To locate or describe exactly or precisely. To find or identify with great accuracy. Another example. All right, I will be recording today's rehearsal. But don't let that make you self-conscious. I'm only using it to pinpoint your mistakes. Man, I, like, always do the right thing. And, like, look where it's gotten me. You know, there's, like, contractors out there that are, like, complete scammers. Mm -hmm. I'm sitting here fixing church stuff for free. Yeah, see, that's your problem, man. You're too nice. Scammer. Someone who makes money using illegal methods, especially by tricking people. Another example. Doesn't mean that in my spare time, I can't find ways to purge Evil Corp of all their shit bags. You know. Your typical subprime mortgage scammers, Ponzi schemers, pension embezzlers, and sexual harassers. I can't wait to see what you do with Koyo House. Mm, okay, there'll be a few weeks of due diligence. A couple of months, max. Yeah, of course, and no skeletons here. <laughs> Good. No skeletons here means there are no secrets or hidden problems. Another example. Has Greg ever mentioned the name Jorge to you? Jorge? I don't know what you're talking about. No, why? Because I think your fiancé may have a few skeletons in his closet that he's not telling you about. And skeletons don't like living in closets. Greg has no skeletons, okay? And listen to me, oh, the really? wedding, he does not. You know that. Yes, I know I that. I see. When he says that, and you hear him saying that, what does that make you want to say? Cards on the table? I want to say he's right. Put cards on the table. To be honest about your feelings and intentions. Another example. You please have some privacy. You, no! I'm as much a part of this relationship as you two. I think it's high time we put all our cards on the table. Yeah, for example, where is this going? Are you two ever getting married? And if so, where will we all live? Have you thought about that? <laughs> What's going on? You seem all riled up. Uh, all my friends had a handyman, so... Contractor. I'm a contractor. I just have to go over there and kiss the ring a little bit. You're catfishing me? No skeletons here. <laughs> Good.